You're listening to SoFloRadio.com. Honey, check it out. Word without a doubt. You're looking rather sensual. I'm headed to your route. But see, I'd rather be stingy with my compliments. That fine line between cocky and confidence can make a woman talk down. Hot women try chilling. You ain't that tall, baby girl. You high healing. Hey, welcome to the show. It's Rick's show on the radio. What are we listening to here, guys? This uh, sounds like a pretty cool rap video here. Yeah, uh, that's, that's me. That's uh, Francis, Francis, Francis Moreau. Moreau. That's uh, uh, opening our show today. Okay, real Cypher. Thank you. Yeah, real cypher. All right. uh, part of a uh, rap duo. All right. Well, we got some great guests here. A lot of talk, a lot to talk about. But let's listen to a little bit of this uh, little. Uh, what's the name of this piece here? It's called Rock with Me. Rock with Me, with Francie Moreau. Mm. I've got a full house here. Let me introduce everybody here. First, I want to acknowledge our producer here, Mr. Jorge George Rodriguez. Stick your face in there and say hello to everybody there. Okay, I can't see you really. Uh, anyway, there you go. All right. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Ed, my, I'm Rick Santees, by the way, and this is my show, Rick's Show on the Radio. That's point to me. That's the right guy. There he is. That guy right there. Right there. Thank you. Thank That's you. the man. And to my right here is like my unofficial co-host, Diana Do I get S. the job Rice. yet? <laughs> We're still auditioning. We're okay, still auditioning. Okay, but, okay. You know. <laughs> yes, uh, she brings me a lot of really cool guests, which I really appreciate. Aww. You you have uh, your your fingers in the pie of like the what's going on around here in, uh, in South Florida All Entertainment. A little, 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 little bit. So it's great to have Diana come on and... Uh, you know, bring me some great guests like, continuing on, Mr. Michael Sanchez. Welcome to the show, sir. Thank you. Thank you for uh, having me. We've been uh, looking at uh, your re- or acting reel. Looks like you got a lot of good stuff going on. Are you consider yourself an actor, producer? I consider myself an actor for now, and then okay. I'll get my foot in the door with other things. Uh, I'm learning a lot from this guy right here, honestly. This guy right here going over here, Mr. Francie Moreau. Oh, man. Thank welcome, you, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome. <sighs> and you are the <laughs> producer guy here, right? Yes, yeah. I am a producer guy. <laughs> I am a. I, l- let me give you the list. Okay, let's do uh, it. Let's, let's, let's everybody take okay, notes. Here we go. Take, take notes. Producer. But uh, you got producer, writer, director, actor, musician, mm-hmm. dancer, uh, philanthropist. Not <laughs> <laughs> No, but I, I dabble everywhere. I'm a man of many hats. I uh, heard you're an arborist as well. Is that true? <laughs> I might be. I don't even know. That's not even inconclusive. That might be something. George, do you know what an arborist is? Uh, lives in a tree? No, he doesn't. You know what? I like tree, climbing but trees, but so that might be true. So. All right. Yeah, yeah, I, no. I'm a tree hugger. Oh, <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. Ultra. Okay, Ultra. so Ultra. producer <laughs> slash arborist <laughs> Francie Moreau joins us as well. He's nice. going to talk about since <laughs> life is an arborist and... All around about trees and stuff like that. <laughs> All enlightened people. He knows nothing about trees, but that's okay. <laughs> All right. And also uh, to your right uh, is Mr. Joseph. J. Joseph Henry. Joseph Henry. Yes. Uh, and you're an actor as well, right? Yes, I am an actor. And um, I'm looking into being a director myself. Okay. I like recording. I'm just now getting into it. But Recording like what? 
music you know, I want to do nah not music I'm, oh. I'm not with the music stuff that's yeah, Francis music, <laughs> yeah. you know it's uh, more into the dramatic area oh, cool. and I liked you know to have whatever's in my mind and to put it on screen I'm, I'm getting into that okay. I feel but acting first that's all my right. first excellent excellent Passion. welcome to the show guys and Diana thank you thank for, thank you for uh, suggesting all these guys here I've been looking at some of the Francie stuff uh, you're welcome you got some uh, pretty interesting projects yeah dude I'm all over the place all right. I'm like in a Samuel good way. L. Jackson. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's a producer in me. <laughs> well, let's in start with you, um, Francie. Um, where are you from? And uh, let's do a little bit of your personal history. Where are you from, and how you got here, and that kind of stuff. Okay. Well, uh, we have to start back with like my parents. You mm-hmm. know, my parents are originally from Haiti, and mm-hmm. uh, my dad, he got on uh, the refugee boat, and he had to uh, go through like a. 14 week process where he had to mm-hmm. travel here and like people were getting sick dying on the boat and everything he uh, survived he weighed what like story. he weighed like a buck 80 and came out like a buck 20 mm-hmm. and uh yeah and he got arrested for like 13 months he started working in the fields and then he got wow. a job finally and then he made me uh-huh. and mm-hmm. i could pretty much say that's where i get a lot of my work ethic from is, is my pops yeah and my mom is a hustler too. Like, she, she's a very, very nice lady. When you see her, she cooks cookies and everything. But she's a hustler. Yeah, you want to say hello to her because we. Hey, are hi, mom, mom. Hi. dad, hi, you guys. Mom. Don't and uh, <laughs> that, that's, that's my personal history. But uh, okay. I was born in Miami, and um, and yeah, uh, ever since I was young, I, I just had a creative spirit. Like how young? Very young. I think when I popped out the womb, yeah. I was drumming and stuff. You're like and this? Just, yeah. <laughs> I probably was with my little Hold stubby on, fingers, yeah, like, yeah. trying to... No, don't take that picture, son. <laughs> <laughs> Give it a few months. Yeah, yeah, dude. Yeah, Let uh, the stretch marks go away. Yeah. Go away <laughs> first. Yeah. Baby back. Uh, no, like... So was it film or music, or what is it that it was first everything. got you going? It was everything, because there was... I never really uh, kind of, you know went towards one direction plug Mm -hmm. uh i always dabbled in everything i never there's never something that i'm favoring most i always like it's like having kids you guys have kids right you don't do you choose favorites? Yes. I mean, that's <laughs> no. No, I don't. I'm pretty sure there's one. Uh, officially. Yeah, no. I mean, but it's like having kids. You know, like, uh, I can't pick a favorite. It's like, uh, to me, not that's not cool. Not publicly, anyway. Well, yeah. Yeah. well, yeah, like, you know, for me, it's like, I, I like all of them the same. Like, I, I, I love all of them the same. I do all of them So the what are you same. doing these days? Oh, everything. You can I mean, think are you of, working uh, on a film project? Or? Working on plenty of film projects. Actually, I'm wrapping up a feature film right now, uh, 5417. Mm-hmm. That's, that stars Michael J. Sanchez and uh, Joseph Rock Henry. Mm-hmm. And it also has um, Joe Marie Payton in it, uh, yeah, which, is, which is Harriet Winslow from Family Matters, um, just in case oh, yeah. anyone wants to know. Oh, wow. And um, I'm also doing Dream So Real. Uh, which also stars uh, Michael J. Sanchez. And I'm also in a film called Powers, uh, which also stars Michael J. Sanchez. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, oh, wow. Which is Trend directed here. by Chris. Uh, what's his last name? Say his last name so he doesn't get mad at me. Uh, 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 Chris We told we told him about us coming on. He was like, "Yo, y'all better get my name." Get right. my name yeah. right. <laughs> you should have told me, Chris. I would have gotten it right. <laughs> See, Diana's a boss. Yeah. <laughs> she's we, we just how did you how did you guys hook up with Diana here? Uh, oh, we you ma- could thank Joe Lamar for that. Uh, Joe yes, Lamar. Joe Lamar. Uh, Joe Lamar had a I am a starving actor's uh, Doc- round table. Docu- yeah, oh, yeah, it's like a docu series, yeah. uh, which is going to be released probably around the summertime. And I we met this beautiful young lady oh. over here. Oh, I love you. And um, you want yeah, to be my best friend. Yeah. Very big hearted <laughs> and uh, definitely good people to know uh, yeah. in the industry here in South Thank Florida. You. You That's know? great. I'm glad to hear this. Yeah. Uh, it's like every time I do the show, I learn something new about like, hey, these guys are doing this, and now these guys are doing that. It's great. Yeah, yeah. it's good to have a forum here, and that's what the show is all about here yeah. to to uh, just emphasize and then showcase uh, the the talent that we have down here, yeah. so that people can hear about it. They know where to go to see some of these projects. Uh, I understand you guys uh, were all down at uh, O Cinema, yeah, for the uh, Indie Film Club's uh, not going to move to L A series on April first. Mm. Mm-hmm. Which I just missed. Darn it! I wanted to get into that one. Yeah. I had, I had my uh, film 
called The Ducks, which a, is yeah. a parody on Alfred Hitchcock's The Birds, <laughs> yeah. which is pretty funny, actually, because actually the more scarier you try to make a duck look, uh, the funnier he gets. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I like the film you did two months ago. It was like two months ago when I met you. Oh, yeah. That, that film was pretty. Yeah, with Alan, yeah, that's, Allen, yeah, that's it forever. Yeah, that's my little. With Poi. Spoil, yeah, yeah Poi Trin. Trin. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, yeah. A lot of cool really people. Good. Rose Warner's in that. Oh, one. yeah, that's awesome. Yeah, yeah, See, definitely. It was you're, fun. You're putting me up on game. I'm finding out a lot about, uh, you know, all this stuff. I'm so sorry. <laughs> yeah. So I got to talk. Now, I yeah, actually, radio. you know what? That's a personal history thing, too. Like, throughout yeah. my life, I actually, when I was younger, I was really loud. And people were like, you're too loud. So I started talking low. And they're like, you're too low. So I'm like, all right, well, I don't know what I am. Well, you're young, so you'll figure it out. When yeah. you'll get it, yeah. <laughs> 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 That's right. <laughs> Well, we got some clips that you guys sent here of some of your projects here. So, but let's go through and talk to everybody first here, Mr. Uh, Michael Sanchez. Hi, how you doing? How you doing? I'm good, good. Oh, good. So, uh, you guys hooked up, or you guys work together a lot, or you do um, some separate stuff too? The way I met Francie was through the uh, 48 Hour Film Project like oh, yeah. two years ago, and uh, we met on a set. We were actually extras in a in a project with uh, it was called Fade to Black, and uh, yeah, I met Francie. I met Peter. Um, Peter. The, the, these are guys who are. Uh, are you know they they're very talented and they they hustle mm-hmm. you know and yeah af- after meeting that day we had so much fun on that set we just from there we just hit it off yeah. all of us and we just like got stuck together we weren't it wasn't even like a like a business relationship we were just like cool like really cool with each other we would just go out in town have lunch eat and even there were times when we were having really rough moments in our lives, you know, and, and I can remember when I was like really, really like broke and Mike would help me out, you know, with food and everything like that. And so, you know, vice versa, we would always do something like that. So it became more than just a friendship and it became like a family. That's great. Yeah. So, so you guys like, uh, tell similar stories then? Yeah, <laughs> I mean, I it depends on what you. Well, we'll yeah, talk I'm about the about stories because that's what really interests me as well. Is uh, what we're trying to say here. That's what inspires. Very, yeah, yeah, that's very important to me. Uh, yeah. What you know, what we're trying to say with these stories. You could say anything we want, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah but uh, you know, if you want to be a leader, you got to have some place to lead people. Right? Yeah, Absolutely. definitely. I come yeah. from somewhere. I agree right? with that hundred percent. Yeah. yeah. All right, say, hey, uh, Joseph, so uh, you're an actor. Hello again. Uh, where do you live? I live actually in Homestead. In Homestead? Yeah. Wow. That's drove, where we are. That's where we're from, me wow. and Francie. Wow. You drove all the way up here? Drove to, all the way up wow. here from you guys. Oh, you know, to uh, SoFloRadio.com. Uh, <laughs> we love Diana yeah. especially. Uh, yes, oh, Diana. Nice. Well, we're going to make the best of it here. We're going to show some of your uh, some of your work here mm-hmm. for everybody Thank to you. see and uh, let you say whatever you want about your uh about your projects here so okay, that the whole absolutely. world okay, can right. hear as a matter of fact uh, i know for sure that somebody's listening in ireland right now i'm going to say <laughs> hello Hi. to my beautiful wife hello, hello there hello hey Hi. she's listening right now she's anxious to hear all about you guys her oh. name is caroline caroline awesome. <laughs> caroline so i know that we got a big <laughs> worldwide audience here awesome right oh. awesome cool <laughs> all right so uh and diana yes I know we uh, spoke to you a couple of times, but um, so I'm saying quiet. Tell me what's going on with uh, what's going on with you just recently? Recently, yeah. well, I, uh, Alicia and I, mm-hmm. aka Aya, we started uh-huh. our own faith-based production company. It's uh-huh. off the ground, and actually, this Saturday we begin our very first project under Rahab Productions. So I'm excited. Uh-huh. We have a real good team. Good. And it's a cooking show for organic health and wellness. It's gonna, it's gonna, it's going to be called This Way to Wellness. That's right. Oh, that's ooh, great. Sounds good. good. So you so, guys really good cooks, huh? No, we're not cooking at all. <laughs> <laughs> I'm produ- I just tell people what to do I'm and they go do it. That. No, Pamela Higgins is um she's a she owns um Total Health Counseling and she wanted to do a cooking show, you know, really vegan and gluten free mm-hmm. and all healthy stuff that these boys probably have no idea about. Mm-hmm. But anyway, <laughs> <laughs> I need to get on that game. Right <laughs> but I got a gluten spread that I like <laughs> to put on. Myself, yes, you know? but it's all about health and wellness, and like we said, and we have um, L.J. Ugarte from um, um, Fire Creek Entertainment. Another He's Come on board, and our DP is Ricardo Valdez, who owns Chronos Films. 
Oh, and he's either. actually, yeah, oh yeah. Like he's way ahead of the game and we are so blessed enough that he Good. has jumped on board to be our DP and I'm so excited about mm. that. Hey, that's a that's one of the things that I uh, that I try to do in my life is to have people around me that are much better than yes, I am. Yes, that is right. <laughs> you know, I have a lot more experience and much better than I am. Yeah. And nice. just, you know, that's... And that's pay it forward. Know. Like that's yeah. why, I, I mean, when I see talent like I have with these guys and I met them on that um, docu-series not that I'm ahead of them at all I think we're all about on the same rung of the ladder actually mm -hmm. you guys are ahead of me which really pisses me off I don't but anyway I, I wouldn't say so <laughs> no. I put up a post of herself like in 95 I was like oh snap <laughs> <laughs> we're with Buffy the Vampire Slayer right now. <laughs> you know what but yeah to pay it forward and I guess like I said before I'm a counselor and a teacher and I just mm -hmm. love that's how I get joy watching people succeed not just myself. You know what? I, I also like the fact I feel comfortable because uh, I have my own faith based um, ideas on yeah. life and all that. And I think we share that. Yes. But um, I see a lot of the things that I do and that you do that aren't like, you know, super religious no, or anything. I'm like not that. about religion. I think we lose everybody when we try to right. be religious about right. it. I'm about relationships. Right. Yeah, relationships. <laughs> and, uh, you know, a lot of the stories that we tell right. have to have some kind of. You, you know, have, to, you have to relate. You know, you don't yeah. want to scare people away. You you want to like you know bring them in. You know, like mm -hmm. the wild horse. You don't want to you know just mm -hmm. like no eat this uh, sugar. It has come to come from the heart. You know exactly. Sure. Yeah. And you know right a lot on. of stories don't have to have happy endings either. You know yeah. a lot of stories don't. Yeah. You know it's that's sometimes the it lesson real. is to oh look what happened to that guy. You know that's yeah. that's, that's that's another thing about stories right. is that yeah, yeah. Don't, has all, a purpose. don't all have to have they oh they do serve a purpose though yeah yeah. So let's talk about some of your stories then. Oh, all right. Oh. All right. <laughs> yeah. well, see if I, uh, I know I got a few of them. these um, stories here that you guys want to do. Some of them are funny stories about uh, relationships and uh, dear future wife is one of them, right? Nice. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah, let's talk about that one first. Didn't you guys work together on that, Diana? Or? Oh, yeah. I worked okay. on Dear Future Wife season one. The way I met... Uh, McKenzie was through uh, the main actor William Alexander. Which is oh yeah, okay. William is somebody I started up when I started acting and put, getting my foot in the door. Is somebody I started uh, working with a lot, and me and him ever since we always helped each other out. And yeah, you know, fast forward a couple years later, I met McKenzie. And I know they were doing this this web series that was get, succeeding on YouTube, mm -hmm. getting a lot of views. Uh, you know, we got a lot of supporters, and you know, it was a blessing to be a part of that. And then like fast forward to season two. We got Diana on board after meeting her on the round table. Uh, I honestly don't know how you guys linked up. Fully, I'm because but. I'm a go getter, and mm. when I saw he that, is. and I'm like, nobody really knows about it down here. I was, um, well, I was, I went and I said, hey, listen, I love what you have here. Like, who's helping you out to promote it? Who's, you know, do you have a producer? La la la, and all that. I met Alicia and I met with McKenson and then McKenson said, Hey, we've been looking for someone to play somebody that looks like somebody. <laughs> <laughs> and of course I always look like everybody. Somebody's, somebody's mother. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's <laughs> always somebody's mother. No, but when I found out that she was gonna produce and he got her on board, I was like, Man, that is now that's, we're moving. that's awesome. That's gonna that's move cool. us for sure. So no, see, I was thank you, you know he, he he you know, with with season two he surprised me with a few things. Yeah. You know, he like McKenzie's very reserved. And I, 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 I he's a very that. artistic oh and all that gosh. stuff, and like you know, seeing some footage and, and stuff, I, I'm very surprised, you yeah. know, about how, how the outcome of season two. And I look forward to people so tuning in. I asked him, like, I go, do you want me to help you? And he's like, sure. And I said, this is what I could do for you. And I put it, you know, me, I always put things out on lists and yeah, type it up yeah, and send like it that. and sign it, and you know, uh -huh. just just because that's how I am. Anyway, and he's like, yeah, let's do it. And I'm like, all right, you just let me know what you need. And anytime he needs something, you know, will you uh, hire? Can I hire you? Actually, I, I like <laughs> yeah, you. yeah. Well, we'll talk about it after. The <laughs> show. <laughs> I always hi highly recommend Diana Rice. Thank yeah, you. Yeah. 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 Aww, she does. I told friends yesterday, oh. Diana, yeah. I know she got a lot on her plate right yeah. now, probably, but gotta, yeah, we got but I, and I won't, and that's the thing. I know when to say no, just because. Yeah, yeah I no, just, you don't want to. If you want to get something done, you give it to a busy person. Yeah, <laughs> it's true. It's true. It works yeah. that way, you yeah. know. Yeah. 
No, but she's really busy. That's the thing. We don't want to. <laughs> I'm not that busy. Yeah. All right. I mean, yeah. I am, but yeah. we'll talk so after. Season we'll, we'll get two, it. huh? How many episodes are in season one? Season one, uh, we have ten episodes. Yeah. That's great. That's a good. So please watch. Uh, please watch uh, and prepare best. yourself. Your wife. Now, where can we see uh, the, the your f- dear future? It's wife? on YouTube. You can find the full uh, first season on uh, YouTube, and then the same thing's going to be with uh, season two. Uh, I'm trying to get some of these guys to get on get on board as well. I, I, everybody's really spread out but yeah. i'm trying to bring them together because we're in homestead yeah. Uh, yeah, people man. don't like to come over well he's in homestead wow. uh, you need to come to palm beach oh my yeah. word yeah. 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 yeah like you know and uh, like he's super south and Mackenzie's super north, north so it's yeah. like oh, it's a north and south thing i like, I, like again my thing is here's the thing about homestead it's it doesn't matter the drive or um it doesn't matter your dedication, yeah. you're still far. <laughs> so the meet up, still far. You know, yeah. the meetup is kind of tough to do. Yeah. So, you know, that's I'm trying to get these two geniuses uh, together, though, man. Yes. McKenzie and Francie. Oh like, gosh, I imagine. would think, like, if, if they were to have if a project, I would say together. this, you know. It might be like we'll a take over force or it's like Ocean. matter and antimatter. And no, 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 no it won't be that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we're talking about what to live It would be perfect. Yeah. It's, yeah, 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 right. Right. it's definitely it still is. Cool. Hollywood is a nice area to live, most sure. Definitely, mm-hmm. yep. It's like right it's in the middle. Decision. Mm-hmm. We actually, we actually plan on shooting a uh, part of Dream So Real for um, here. So oh, yeah, okay. that's gonna be really nice. Well, yeah. let's get to um, let's play some of this uh, material you guys got here. Okay, let's introduce everybody to Dear Future Wife. You guys got a trailer. Mm-hmm. We're gonna play that first, and then I'm gonna play. The uh, promo for season two yes. that you guys are involved. So right now okay, we're cool. going to watch uh, the trailer for Dear Future Wife. Anyway. You were trying to tell me something about your cousin earlier. Yeah, I think he's into something illegal now. Yo. Illegal stuff like what? Well. Have you... Have you ever cheated on me, Sash? Well, I was wondering if you weren't doing anything later. Maybe you want to check out a movie? Can I suggest something? No. Okay, see, I think you should just pop up. Ms. Brown? Yeah, he's on. Wait, wait. Sasha, is he expecting you? Sasha, what are you doing here? Wait, I just want to talk. No, I've been listen. calling you. You've been ignoring my calls. I just no, 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 We're gonna change the intro. We're gonna, we're gonna, instead of day, it's gonna be a long time. By the way, we're gonna keep. We just played the promo for season two yes. there, right? Yes. Yeah. We were gonna play the original trailer there, so but that's see that's that's the one that Diana you're involved in, right? I'm producing that and mm-hmm. season yeah. two, and also I I'm in that as well. So what was he gonna tell the lady? Nothing. Nothing. No, no, no. Nothing. You have to come watch. Come watch all of season one, and when you're done, right. you'll be on the on the hanging cliff there, yeah, and then you'll have to watch season two. I recommend people oh, start watching season one right now, now so you can you understand it. Be awesome. ready now for I season watch two. It. Now so you got to ca- caught up on it. Yeah, like you and I Caroline did. need to watch that together. All right, yeah, Caroline. We were, yeah. Well, she's my. Dear real <laughs> wife, so there. yeah, <laughs> not your yeah, your dear now wife, yeah. your dear future wife. All right, anyway, let's uh, let's go back, back in time. Okay, <laughs> rewind, time. rewind to, back, back to the, the back promo to the of dear future wife. Let's watch the other one here. This is this yes. will introduce us to the series, right? Season one. Well, I might as well introduce myself. I'm Brandon, and that right there is my self-centered cousin, Jordan, (laughs) who's currently actually living with me until (laughs) Lord knows when. He and I are like night and day when it comes to women. He's a bit more aggressive. 
Then you got smacking on the butt. Women like that. That's for me. I kind of don't give myself enough credit. <laughs> Better yet, why don't you guys follow me on this journey to finding myself a wife? So you guys got uh, mm. Mm. ten episodes down yeah, already ten episodes. for season one, and you're starting se- season two already. Yeah. Right? Season one will be—I mean, season two will be dropping it. soon. Yeah, very soon. That's great. Very, it, very soon. It better be. <laughs> 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 All right, great. And Diana, so, yeah. you play uh, somebody's mom again, right? I don't know, can no, I tell? Right. I shouldn't tell. No, I'm not going to tell. Should I tell? I don't know. McKenzie's told, not here to tell so. me if I'm allowed to tell. <laughs> <laughs> I already told. So. I know somebody's uh, mother. Perfect for you. Perfect. Always. Brother. There you go. That's all you're getting, though. <laughs> <I know. laughs> yeah. You got to watch more for that, that one. That is right. <laughs> all right. Well, good luck with that project. That oh, looks yeah. pretty cool. No, definitely. And um, oh, now, Francie, you now nice. you, uh, I just saw that. you're not working on any of the Dear Future Wife stuff, right? No. You know what? Like I said, he's going to. Now he wants to be. I'm a, I'm like a, what's the word? Consultant? Supervising? type of guy with McKenzie's like we talk a lot oh. we text each other some, from time to time mm-hmm. uh for a very reserved person he texts us like a lot of exclamation marks which is cool man <laughs> which is cool man I'm with you bro but um that's okay my wife but uh puts all her posts in capital letters too so yeah she's you know, yelling at you yeah. that, that means know, she's yelling yeah. at you well, that's, a, that, that's a, a sign of excitement excitement yes, yeah. Yeah. on McKenzie's part that's I don't like, know about Caroline <laughs> if he did anything you know We'll vouch for him. But, uh, <laughs> no, you guys will. I'm sure. I'm pretty sure down the line yeah, it's going to happen. When it's Definitely. meant to be. When yeah. it's meant yeah. to be right now, when it's it not is. supposed See, to happen. This is why I like Diana. She's always like, look, when it's, when it's going to happen, it's going to happen. Man, that's why. Faith. Amen. If it's supposed to happen, you know, it'll, that, it'll, it'll, it'll happen. happen. Right, man. Everybody Absolutely. needs to know that. Absolutely. Yeah. And, and I definitely feel like it will. You know, mm-hmm. with him, I, I can see it. He's very creative. Mm-hmm. And we're both like coming from the same type of you know mind state and creativity so it's it's bound to happen so definitely and my thing is i do like um to bring talent together because i feel like that's gonna bring a lot of good work yes you know I, like I, i've been telling francie this i've been telling jesse all my friends like you know all my friends within like yo like we have something here, man. Yeah, like, no, we you know, don't need to go anywhere like, you know? else. That's I true. agree. Yeah, That's exactly. why I'm, That's I'm a South fighter for about. us. Yeah. <laughs> it's true. That's but, right. but, you know, you, you, sometimes it happens. You, you question it sometimes. Of course. From yeah. time to time. But, yeah, South Florida, I would like to. This is where I started. You know, I'm not from here, but this is where I, I got my foot in the door. This yeah. is where I started. And I, w- mm-hmm. I would like to put on for the city that put on for me. Yeah. yeah like, not? you know, like that would be really Absolutely. ideal. You know, I wouldn't want to have to move to another yeah. city, you know, I have to do all that. Well, that's what we're doing right here, especially on the show here, mm-hmm. you know, yeah. talking about it and uh, bringing other people on board that have same ideas about the South Florida yeah. talent here. It's a much more powerful uh, film community than people out there think it is. Like, there's so many connections within, like, the talent down here. People really don't know. Like, we're connect. Like, you know, the six degrees of separation thing. Mm-hmm. Kevin there's Bacon. so mm-hmm. many, like connections down here with people that we have right yeah that it's ridiculous like we didn't even realize it until we went to like old cinema and all these other places like oh snap i know you i know like i've seen your stuff like see my stuff can we start something new very small six six degrees separation of diana's race oh yeah (laughs) (laughs) well uh, diana i think that they use kevin bacon as just an example oh okay (laughs) and it can be anybody oh can it because i only hear kevin bacon oh okay well we'll start the south florida version yeah oh nice so would you guys um (laughs) think about the Dade Broward separation. Uh, don't you think? I don't. Like it's I don't, I don't think it's a separation at all. I, I mean, I work with people in Broward. I work with people Palm in Dade. Beach, yeah. too. And, and yeah, Palm, Palm Beach. It's a SoFlo thing, Kansas. man. SoFlo. So 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 That's right. Yeah. I always hashtag. Listen, so anytime you guys are on set, please put that hashtag SoFlo talent. And that's it. Every picture on Instagram and you know everything. And Hashtag SoFlo so Talent. Oh, I already we did, did that on Snapchat. Okay, Just good. When we got in. Oh, yeah, so perfect. Yes, yeah, so yeah. we're going to yeah. hashtag you too. We're definitely got to do that, man. You know, we're developing uh, SoFlo TV here, mm-hmm. which is something that we're going to try to put, uh, you know, a lot of content on, you know. Like, that's good. Namely, uh, Dear Future Wife or anything that you guys got. That oh, yeah. Absolutely. I have a list. Uh, why not? I mean, yeah, we have a list of stuff. You hear that, George? Yeah, so let's get let's get working on it, all right? We working. Let's do it. All right. Okay. So, uh, Francie, 
I was yeah, I'm about to. You brought some uh, some material here as well. Some uh, material. Yeah, some uh, trailers. I trailers, mean, and I brought gifts. I came bearing gifts, gifts as well. All right, we'll we'll. So we'll, I'll <sighs> present those later. <laughs> we'll, yeah. we'll smoke some of those later. <laughs> 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 only kidding, only kidding. No, um, anyway, uh, you, you <laughs> sent me an email with like a whole bunch of trailers and a whole bunch of things. Yeah. I so how many? Uh, tell me, how old are you, and how much? How much uh, project? How many projects have you uh, completed and worked on so far? Man, I'm like 155 years old. No, yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm just I'm an old soul. That's what I'm trying to say. But um, I'm actually 26. Um, I've I have a lot of projects uh, under completed. my Completed. Com- uh, well. They're about to be completed. Well, we I have uh, one short film that actually uh, premiered at a theater down in Homestead um, in 2011, which stars this guy. It's called Ill, means uh, If Love Lost. He right. was in it, and he killed it. Like, he, yeah. Did he destroyed. The, yeah. yeah, he made everyone just, they were in awe. So uh, I still don't know how to react right. to it yeah. when they say it like that. I I just, you know, oh, it's a good. Performance to me. Stay it's like just, that. It's really good. Stay I, humble, we're gonna show Diana in a you know. Yes, I after can't this. wait. All um, right. I but, think it's hard for any actor to hear the compliments. I, yeah, I still feel true. weird when true. people compliment me. Is that like if Love Lost? Is that like a short film or is it? A it's a short film. film. It's a short oh, film. It is? Okay. Yeah, and then um, I, after if Love Lost, uh, I started making fifty four seventeen. Now tell us about that. What is what's fifty four seventeen? Fifty four like a Bible verse. It is a Bible verse. Isaiah. That? That's yeah. really good. Isaiah. Isaiah. Right. Uh, no I weapon formed against you shall prosper. Um, so what? What is it? How does it go? Uh, no weapon formed against you shall prosper. Oh. Or you know, there's it's many different famous, versions. Yeah. Sure. But, you know, basically, that's yeah. really. Oh no, it's right there. Yeah. Oh, is this it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That should be it. <laughs> okay. Oh, so uh, it's Isaiah. Okay, no, no, that's not so uh, give wait, me a little bit idea about. It? Wait, it should be on. No, because I, I emailed the, that too. Yeah, you emailed that. Give too. us a little idea actually. about what fifty four seventeen is about, and we'll watch a little bit about that's that. Okay. All right. Well, just to give you a gist, uh, mm-hmm. fifty four seventeen right. deals with um, gun violence, and you uh-huh. know uh, any any weapon form of violence, and all the stories that you know basically contain that, like. Mm-hmm. Um, like a you know like the Trayvon Martin right uh, situation uh, Michael Brown um, the Sandy Hook you know gang violence anything that pretty much has to deal or have dealt with gun violence mm-hmm. is what the film is about and it focuses on those stories but the main story um, which it follows is is about a gunsmith a young gunsmith who actually makes these weapons and he realizes all the weapons that he makes are in all those events. Right. And so he has to make a decision upon himself and um, his family and just the future of people if he should continue doing um, his profession or if he should stop. So uh, Well, I'd say, uh, you know, that's a pretty good or a pretty um, eventful it's interesting. relative subject that we talk about right now. Yeah. Uh, you know, I mean, I know I there's a lot important. of things that are... Yes, absolutely. Uh, but what if somebody was to make a... What if he was a car maker and there's a lot of people that get killed by cars? So. Yeah, well, that's a difference. Though, that's, that's a whole different. Yeah, that's mm-hmm. a different avenue. What I really yeah. wanted to focus on was, you know, this is such a, this is such a common thing that's been happening, you know, in the, in the American culture. You know, the death of people shooting each other. Yeah, yeah. people shooting each other Absolutely. in any realm, really. From you know, of course, the the uh, cop violence against you know minorities and black on black violence and everything like that it's it, the issues are are so, they're so there in our face but they're never really touched on and then just the fact that it's um touching on the uh the middleman which is the gunsmith is a story wow. that's never been told right. okay. so it's good. i feel like it's very good and then being it from a gunsmith that's of african-american culture right it, it will you know be even more powerful because then he has to face a reality where it's like you know how trayvon martin was killed by you know mm-hmm. Zimmerman and you know there's black on black crime always mm-hmm. and you know there's always an uproar when a cop kills someone yeah. who's black but you know when right. some black kills someone's black no yeah. one really says yeah. anything yeah. so exactly. it's it's just something that I feel like it's a very important top topic to talk about sure. and we have to look at it like it's not something that's going to go away anytime soon all right well I'm glad uh maybe later we can talk about a similar project that I'm working on that I'd like to talk to you guys about 
All right. Uh, well, it has to do with the that. same thing. Uh, but uh, let's watch a little bit of that trailer here for 5417, okay. all right? Nice. I've been formed against you. Morality that'll come later. What's somebody following me? You ever been on a stakeout before, man? Look like your father named you, I say. This ain't a game. It's real life. Real people. Real hate. This is a war. 5417. No weapon formed against you shall prosper. You die in the nurse, you die in the nurse. So hop in that water and pray that it works. Some, uh, that's pretty powerful yeah, stuff, man. For, I mean, the editing and the acting, uh, yeah. but uh, man, that music is really awesome, too. Thank you, thank you. Uh, is that original stuff? Uh, the Where'd you get that? The music, you know, I got that from Music Bed. Uh, okay. You get stuff from Music Bed. Um, well, it's... it's the, shout out to Kendrick Lamar. Shout out to Kendrick place. Lamar, by the way. Uh, that's the person's song who's playing at the end. Kendrick Lamar is uh, a rapper um, wow. which, who's very controversial and polarizing, and I chose his music especially because because he touches on those topics. Mm. Right. And he's that type of artist that would do that. So, mm. Mm. yeah. Wow. Well, that's a, a, a very relevant subject here. Yeah. Uh, Definitely. Gun violence or black on black crime or whatever it is you want to talk about. Yeah. I, I think I, that's a very so relevant topic. Can topics. we see it? Like, it's what, a big screen. It, what it, We've been getting this question a lot. Uh, <laughs> yeah. That's a tease. Like, you yeah, know, yeah, we yeah. want to see it. Yeah, yeah uh, we want to do a big screening mm -hmm. in um, July. We want to do it in July. Yeah. We want, we're going to do a press junket um, either in May or June, and we want to do a big screening for it in July. And you with, got a along place to with do that, it at? Yeah, we have we have a couple of venues we've been okay. looking at. Um, what, is there some you're suggesting? Yeah, Because yeah. you, you look Cinema, like you want Cinema Paradiso. So I'm hearing, you know what? Film carpet. Yeah, you know, people have been telling us about that too. Yep. So we, we actually want to do it in many venues because everyone wants to really see it. Like, okay. we've been getting a lot of calls, messages from people. So they, they want to, you know, play it in certain areas. And there's, you know, many Good. places that we should be able to mm -hmm. show it, so. is it. Is the film done? Is it? Is it uh, it's 90% done. Uh, there's things, well, personally, just because of me. People, it's not because of anybody else. It's because of me. I just want to add more things to it. Ah, you're uh, a perfectionist. You know, uh -huh. That's my problem. Oh my. That's the problem with me. Uh, I want to make it the best it can be. You don't have a producer up your butt to make you do a time thing? No. That's oh, dude. That is a problem. That is. I'm, the, I'm technically the producer, so ah. it's like... Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Uh -huh. hey, here's, so. the thing. here's the thing I like about Francie. You know, I got I to gotta say it, man. When, oh, I, when I met this guy, I... I saw that he, you know, he's like one of those people like, oh, we got to get this done. Like, you know, we can't have it handed to us. We got to, you know, I got a camera. I got this. Let's do it. Let's run with it. Yeah. And on top of that, like seeing his work, I saw Ill and all that stuff. And I'm like, bro, for what you did, that first film, that was that was awesome. You yeah. know, and uh, and the fact that he's just like, yo, you got to get up. We can't wait for people. We got to we gotta do yeah. it. Yeah, you know? that's good. That's a and doer right there. I'm a, yeah, I'm so a doer. doer. I yeah. do. You know, and I, I appreciated that, you know. Much. And I'm like, yo, I got to. Yeah, and I, and, and I can work. tell just We're by looking at it that it's got a pro look. Oh, you know, it's not like, you wow. know, a lot of times you get people with a camera, it looks like you're shooting a birthday party, you know, your kid's birthday party <laughs> with a camcorder. Yeah. 
You know, but that Her yours iPhone. looks nice. Yeah. Looks well, amazing. he has a real, I mean, not that you guys aren't real actors. Sorry, guys. No, all of you are real actors. But Joe Marie Payton, yeah. Urkel's mom yeah. from shout Family out, Matters. Yes. yes. Please, shout out to Joe Marie Payton. Wow. That woman is wow. so wonderful. Like, she has such a wonderful soul just uh, uh, away from the screen. Like, she's uh, just cool. an amazing person. And she's a vet. Like, there were times, like, where I was acting with her in a scene, and she'd, like, she, I didn't know she would fumble lines because I wrote it, <laughs> sure. but it didn't even feel like it. I'm like, you're bringing the character to life so much, like you're making it better than what I wrote. So That's it's great. It's amazing. Like she's really amazing. Let me tell you, every act, actor, actress in this film was great. They were excellent from day one to the end. Like they, they did everything. This guy, he, this yo, guy, he, on the radio, he, remember he. Um, yeah. Pointing Joseph, to Joseph, Joseph he Henry. had a Joseph Henry, he had a, everybody. He had a throbbing headache, and oh, he did man. a running scene and a <laughs> death scene, and he was just doing it the whole day. And that takes <laughs> dedication. Yeah. He had that's tears a, in his eyes. That's a pro. That's right how there. bad the headache was. Wow. Same thing with this guy. Dedicated, dedicated, coming all the way from where he was down to Homestead, mm. just to do you know that. And that was that was a lot of actors. Uh, Jay Gutierrez. Um, Thomas Falborn, oh, yeah. Peter, David Porras, Katrina, David Porras. It was just so many David people. Too, oh, David Porras, too. David Porras was in it right. as well. That's the that's one of the thing I I the things I like about our crew, our um, team of actors and and directors and everybody and and one is that the the dedication we have to what the craft that we do. It's something that's within. We love what we do, mm-hmm. so it doesn't matter what's the obstacle. You know, there's times we mm-hmm. were almost shot filming. Oh yeah, stuff that we didn't even we bring out stories. yet. Uh-huh. We have stories for days. You know, it's like we don't look at the bad. We like we are in a in a in a standpoint that if we die for it, then we were living what we're supposed to do because we love it either way. Mm-hmm. If you're gonna die for something, might as well. You know, well, you have to tell me that well, story. I don't want to go. I wouldn't want to go out like that anyway. <laughs> 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 I'll be like, yo, I still got a little bit. More. I still got a little. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah, yeah, like twenty. Are you a martyr? Yeah, he's a martyr. Yeah, yeah. yeah man. But yeah, I would. Yeah, if people are gonna say that about me. Mike got a shot doing what he loves to do. Then yeah, that's a good yeah, way. Yeah, that's Mike died doing go. what he loved to but do. But you're hearing it now, though. I'm here still, so yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We're not like, trying to go. Out here sounds like you got some really good people that are working on this project with you, and I can tell by the way that they're acting and the way that it's produced that um, it's got a good story, and that's what they're that's what they like about it. Yeah, and I actually, find that when you have yeah. a story that people want to go, yeah, and believe I want to be part right. of that. Mm-hmm. I want I want my kids. To know that I was a part of that, yeah. Then this stuff gets done. It's a good work, yeah. And a good work always gets done, right? Yes, <laughs> that's true. Nice, that's yeah. awesome. No. Yeah, man. Absolutely, absolutely. And story uh, is, uh, for me, story goes a long way as an actor. I like story. Yeah. I don't want to. Oh, yeah. I story. always want to read a script. Yeah, I and to be honest, I read a script. And I mean, now that I'm two years, I read the script, then I pray about it, and mm-hmm. then I give my answer. Mm-hmm. Yeah, oh, you know, like yes. I'm like, give me a couple a, of days. I need to know. Well, a good I, script, a good script, always bring it, bring out the best in the actor. Sure. Why I say that? Because you want to be part of that script. You want to get that role good. because the script is as but good. So does the director and the editor. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I have to say, of course, yeah. of course. Yeah. Yeah. without without well, them, everybody you know, involved. Just, uh, yeah. yeah, but look at it this way. You know, uh, actors. You know, they they want to get paid and all that kind of stuff. Everybody wants to get paid. Yeah. I don't care you about know, that. and they'll do work that pays them. Yeah. Is one thing, but they all want to go to be known as like Michael Sanchez, uh, most known for his role as whatever, right. yeah. and that's the one. You know, we're looking for that. That's what you're looking for is that story, that role that, that you, know, you know. Wow, that he played that guy, and that's yeah. what you remember forever. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I want to be known for many stories, though. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like. Yeah. I don't want to be typecasted. That's one of my fears. It'll happen. You know what I mean? Right. I know but, it'll. It, it might happen, but you know, it's but, like. But when choosing a project to be make yourself involved in, you're always looking for that. You know that role that's gonna really yeah. propel you and, and really yeah. solidify. Yeah, if, as long as it gets your foot in the door. I mean, there's a specific place where I would want to get tight past it mm-hmm. that will get my foot in the door. Mm-hmm. But like, as long as it gets your foot in the door, usually it's like that, from there you can show you, can show you know yeah. your range and whatnot. Yeah. You know I mean? So I, I that's like Kevin Hart right now. I, people ask him, "Oh, do you uh you think do you see yourself doing serious stuff?" He said, "It'll happen when it happens." Yeah. I got that in me, but yeah. right now I'm, you know, I'm doing what I got to do. Yeah. yeah. All right. So um I mean, 
what about this other project here, Dream So Real? What can you tell me about that one? Let me tell you about yeah. Dream So Real. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that is, that's written by C.J. Staples, and it's a very great script. It's beautiful. Hi, C.J. Beautiful script. Yeah, What's C.J. Up, CJ? <laughs> Is he watching? <laughs> he's probably not watching. <laughs> <laughs> no, but we download that. Yeah, but he's yeah. cool. No, no, no. He's he's great, and um, it, it's it's a wonderful script. That's why you know I picked it up, and um, I'm directing it. He wrote it, and uh, it also stars uh Michael J. Sanchez, and he's playing. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> he's he's, he's, he's all over the place, and he's uh. I try to be. He's 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 playing um the role of uh. Stanley, the dreamer, which is the dreamer. Basically, the story is uh, about a, a a young man who actually finds out that his uh, reality is someone else's dream. Oh. Yeah, wow. so it's really it's trippy. To make a long story, I wonder how short. you do that <laughs> cinematically. Anyway, oh, we'll see. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, we're you are. We're gonna yeah. go in with that. Uh, I mean, awesome. I, yeah, team. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's watch a little bit of that. What do you say? Watch we're that running teaser. out of time. I want to watch this stuff, Erica. All right. Definitely, so let's definitely. watch a little Throw teaser of Dream So Real. Right. Dreams. One of the most mysterious and mesmerizing events in the human experience. You can fly, save the world, you can even fall in love. The possibilities are limitless. If you can remember them. They say that most people forget 90% of every dream that they have. But what happens when your dreams remember you? Here, Diana. What are you doing? <laughs> Diana's like, I am for her. Like, Puerto Rican. Yo, what, what I, you know what I'm saying? This is, this is, this I shaved this morning. Smooth baby skin. Smooth. I plucked this morning. Okay, sorry. <laughs> no, that looks uh, very intriguing. Very intriguing. Yeah, yeah no, no, no. It's, uh, it's, it's, it's amazing, man. The story itself is going to really just rock people's world like it's it's very trippy it's out there it's gonna make you kind of think like what if you were in that situation mm, yeah i yeah, like trippy so, yeah no it's, it's great it's great and Deep we stuff. did an indiegogo oh, and yeah? man when i tell you from the minute we posted it it just went straight to the goal That's like, really great. yeah because wow. people just love People That's want hard. that, you That's know. People want too. that. Yeah, it's very <laughs> hard to do. <laughs> to raise that money. And yeah. people just want that. They want stories, you know, yes. that that are like that. They they want to know, you know. Yeah. They want you to touch on different things and be unique, and that's that's what we're about. Mm. Want you to make wow. that versatility. Shout out to CJ Staples. Shout, shout out to CJ Staples. Shout out to, shout to CJ everyone. Will Will Alexander is also starring. Yeah, in William Alexander. Shout out to um, Will. Oh, Who son. else? Kendall, Blakely, <laughs> yeah. all these other people. Yeah, everyone's sta everyone's starring like, it, and we're meeting a, a lot more um, actresses and actors and mm -hmm. producers and everything. So it's great. It's great. Mm -hmm. That's great, man. So when can when is that one uh, available? That one would should be available uh, same time as fifty four seventeen. So July, July, June. Wow. That summer that summer um, window is really what we're trying to hit. Hi, right, Francie. You want to come back when they're about ready to be shown somewhere? And, uh, you know, absolutely. We'll talk about it and absolutely. People go out there and mm -hmm. no doubt. go out absolutely. and see where they're at. I definitely want to come out and see that. I, I will am. have you come out yeah. and see it. You too. Yeah, George Everyone. too. George Everyone. is allowed. I let Giant him out here once in a while. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. absolutely. Except Wednesdays and Thursdays. He's not allowed out on Wednesdays. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> he can't play then. Mm -hmm. nice, nice. Other than that, he's allowed. Awesome. But he can't stay out late. That's awesome. That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, I, that's too bad though that you can't stay out late. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah. Wow. yeah. We uh -huh. have we have a lot a lot of other things. I don't know if you have time to. Yeah, I got like ten minutes. Ten minutes. Okay, Go ahead, let's, man. Tell me all let's about fire your everything. Here. Yeah. So we have powers. Um, director is Chris. Uh, 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 Arisa, 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 Arisa,
it's and, a comedy. And didn't a, you just play that at O Cinema? We yeah, played yeah, that we at O Cinema. Cinema. It's a sci-fi comedy. We played that at O Cinema along with other films, and it was so received well. It was received yeah. so well, and we we got we got a lot of uh, connections to it. And Did you get a lot of fuzzy animals thrown at you? For yeah, that one? Chris got a lot of balls thrown. At his, yeah, at, 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 fuzzy yeah. balls thrown yeah. at his face. <laughs> just in case. Just in case. Hey, that's show. Dave Gia, right? Mm-hmm. Shout Dave out to Dave. Gia, shout out yeah. to Dave Gia. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Dave. I know him. He's good. Yeah, guy. absolutely, mm-hmm. absolutely. We have that. Um, also, well, tell us about what that. The, oh, what is that about? Well, it's powers. about powers. Is about uh, give us group, a high concept. A high concept. Well, powers is about a group of friends. Uh, the main friend, Mike, which is played by Michael J. Sanchez. Michael said, Sa- "Wow, well, he's what a all old, yeah. yeah. <laughs> man." <laughs> It's tall. Yeah. That's what it is. That's what tallest. it is. Yeah. That's what it is. Uh, when he he uh <laughs> one night with his friends he uh he he he's watching the stars or whatever he's looking at the stars and uh, a star passes by it somehow gives him like these special powers mm. and he goes to tell us what what's happened to him um eventually throughout the day and uh. What we discover is that aliens have given him the power, and they're going to take it away from us until we have to prove to them that we'll do right by the powers and everything wow. like yeah. that. So, yeah, so it like, is. It's very. It's it's all over the place. But trust yeah. me, once you watch it's it, you fun. understand people, you know, exactly people, what I'm. People will say it's fun. It's a fun it's a fun film. film. It's, it's fun. fun film. It's fun. Yeah, that sounds great. And that and uh, that was a short film, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I look forward to seeing that one. That looks cool. Mm-hmm. I have an, uh, yeah, yeah cool. and I also have a, a lot that I'm doing too. I got. Totally. Uh, I'm gonna work with John Vargas. You're gonna have him oh, on yeah. the ninth on the show. Yeah, he's on the uh, 19th, I believe. I'm right? Finally, the ninth, gonna or next Thursday. The ninth. Is it next Thursday? Oh, the, yeah, yeah, next yeah. Thursday. Then, yeah. That's yeah. right before the film carpet event yeah, by right. uh, Alexander yeah. Bayo. Yeah. John, then, yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. He's uh, mm-hmm. yeah. We, come on. When next, next Thursday? Thursday with John? I'm, I'm supposed to go to the yeah. film carpet so event. So is he. I yeah. know. You know. Okay, maybe we'll go. You'll probably, you'll probably right, we'll see, see us there too. We'll see. But yeah, I'm working with him. You finally, guys finally going to do a collaboration with him and stuff like that. And then uh, another film that I, you know I'm probably going to work with. I don't know if you ever heard of Walter. Um, Benz Walter Benz Jr. Yeah, Yay. Walter Benz Jr. Uh, yeah, I'm going to be yeah, working that's with him one you too, bring too as well. To. Mm-hmm. Yeah, dude, is very genuine guy. I, uh, love him. I met him. I actually met him through regular work, you know, mm-hmm. and whatnot. But uh, very genuine guy. You know, he's another passionate individual and. Yeah, actor, I, I look writer. forward to actor and writer. He's okay. actor and writer. Yeah, so and he's gonna direct, right? Isn't he directing I, this? No, oh, I don't no. think, I don't think he's cri- directing yeah. that. But um, Brian is. But yeah, Brian. he's he's also gonna star in it as well. But yeah, he's a uh, Walter Binns Jr. Walter Binns Jr. Hi, Walter. Okay. A lot of stuff. <laughs> Let me. Uh, ahead, there's, Francis. there's still more stuff. Uh, we also had a short film with Peter Martin, which he directed called Fellow Men. You can find that on Vimeo. Um, What's it called again? It's Fellow Men. Fellow men. It's about the zombie apocalypse. Oh. We're all trapped in one room, and we have to figure out how to get along with each other. And um, also have a web series that we did uh, called Purity. You can check that out on my YouTube channel. We're gonna revamp that for the summertime. Um, now, give us your say the whole thing over. Your what is your sure. web channel? Who yeah. you are? You know, so when people are oh everything just tuning oh. in. You know, okay. You well, able to go to your channel. So okay, look, my name is Francie Moreau, uh, director, writer, actor, cinematographer, editor, everything you possibly think of. I also do birthdays and <laughs> and, uh, and arbor. He's an arbor <laughs> and weddings and weddings and weddings. Yes, I do weddings. Um, <laughs> but I, I might I have to get into it, man. Yeah, I have to get into it. Uh, uh, my YouTube channel, you can find my YouTube channel. It's Top Boy Cipher. So go. if you're going to search, search it because I don't really know the URL uh. <laughs> myself, but search it. It's Top Boy Cipher, mm-hmm. uh, T-O-P-B-O-Y uh, space C-Y-P-H-A. And you will find everything on there, trailers, um, right. purity web series and everything like that. Yeah. Um, also, I also want to shout out to my little brother, um, Eric Moreau. He's coming out with a short called Traitor. It's amazing. That? Really? It's oh, amazing. He's family. the future. He's the future, uh, my little brother. And I'm I'm very proud to say that he's coming up after How me. How old is so. he? He's like, I'm going to say this right, Eric. Don't worry. He's <laughs> like 22, oh, 22, wow. 21, 22. All right. So, Feel bad not knowing my little brother's age, but 
But no, like he's 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 coming up um, right after me. He's he's gonna be amazing. So and, your dad, um, your dad, is he proud of you guys for his family all jumping my, in? into My film dad, business my here? dad, he's proud of us regardless. You know, sure. he 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 kind of doesn't know that we're dabbling into this. So when we show him, it's gonna be crazy. Mm. You gotta understand, oh, yeah. man. It's different. It is. Our culture is very yes. different. Uh, mom, it's yeah. it's not the same. You know, like what do you mean? Yeah, they're they're, not, they're, they're very conventional. Like you know, you gotta work. Sure. Get it's nine about to five. Coming. Yes, my mom's the same way. Yeah. And so we, if you do oh, this, yeah. it's a whole different no, no, ball no. game. She's like, like you gotta you have to. Sh- you have to do it first, mm. then show them. Right. Oh, okay. yeah. She thinks I'm fooling around. Absolutely. Fooling around. And yeah. she's like, I did not come to this country for you to do this. And I'm you just like, but mom. Yeah, until they see what the is this? Product. Well, yeah. I thank God my mom doesn't think that way. <laughs> really? Before, yeah, before, before, Ill, before ill. Before ill. Before the premiere, actually. Before the premiere. When they found out I was going to the premiere and everyone was going, Daniel was like, oh, you serious wow. about this? But you wow. were serious I would get the yeah. worst looks and everything. Well, you know, That's not how you make money. It, it's yeah. true. I mean, it's unusual. But you know, uh, I guess it takes a lot of convincing sometimes when you you want to go into the film or acting or any period. or entertainment. Yeah. It's not really taken seriously by a lot of people. Right. It's like yeah. playing around, and that's what's going on of. in South Florida. I see. Well, with myself, yeah. I see. Um, not that I'm weeding people out because I love all the humans, but like I see who I want to work with that's professional and that yeah. is like, yeah, you'll sign the dotted line and you'll show up on time mm-hmm. because if you show up on time, you're late. Yeah. In my right. book, exactly. because that's how I am, you 15 know. Fifteen minutes early, at yeah. least. Yeah, and just stuff like that, like that's to teach Marine people does it. how to do it, to do it right, and take it serious. Like when you're yes. on set, be professional. Mm-hmm. I'm like, yeah. So I've two years of this, and I've already like, okay, I never want to work with you, but I want to work with you. You know. Good, good, good. I think you have to really be able to please Diana <laughs> in a in yeah. a very professional sense well, if you're not professional about yours <laughs> you she's definitely well, not i like the way she's to. talking yeah. no yeah, yeah you absolutely have, you have but it's true it's true it's very true i don't want to deal mm-hmm. with it's you. very true also i want to shout out martel harding we have a film coming out knock knock um he's going to drop it in o cinema martel mm-hmm. man I, I you know what i'm saying they're trying to push me out i'm trying to put you <laughs> in bro <laughs> <laughs> you know what i'm saying yeah. well, you got him in you got him in yeah. i got him in i'm trying to get you know everyone everyone all right all right joseph you want to say that's it oh do we have time First, yes. well, yeah, what, I, yeah. what I wanted to say is the reason why we, me, Mike, and Francie, it doesn't feel like we, we we need to be professional with each other is because of the love we have so and the love. respect we have for we, the each love. other. Mm-hmm. The love. That's the only it's thing. I'm professional, you know, but we still, <laughs> <professional. laughs> you know, Mike once, is the most unprofessional he's person like Diana ever. Sitting no, right no, next to me. I'm professional. <laughs> to each no, other, we, we are like just regular, but regular. once yeah. on the outside, if you look at us, it's like you know, these people are not getting paid, yeah. but they have a certain work ethic, you know yeah. what I mean? Yeah, we tell by your product. Yeah, that's, that's we, all I gotta say. Yeah, that's why you, I wanted you, you guys we, up we here that. because no, but of on that. set, no, but he, all right, he comes off yeah. like goofy and whatnot. But on set, on when he's set, directing, we he's, get he's, no. he shuts serious. It down. Like, like I'm talking we, about, he gets serious. I want to get serious because I don't, like, I don't serious, like playing around. He no. gets serious. Yeah. Time really Sometimes is money. they tell me like, Unless I'm doing a comedy. If I'm doing a comedy, this has to be the best. So let's go. And that's what I love. We don't want to waste time. You don't want to. And it's a respect for everyone at the production. If people are coming for free to do your stuff, you need to respect everyone, the actor, the people. People, the food, the mm-hmm. whoever's picking up the trash, whatever trash. it is, and respect the place, the respect property, the everything, and the Absolutely. time. Mm-hmm. Gotta, you attitude, gotta be a, a, a wise Definitely. steward of your time and money. That's Absolutely, true. that's true. All right, well, I look forward to um, seeing your guy more of your stuff. I really do, and and I look forward to you guys moving up to Hollywood from Hollywood, Florida. Not Florida. 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 Don't you dare <laughs> leave, my buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Florida. 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 We, we're, we're not going to leave to L.A. anytime soon. Right. But you're going to move from uh, we're, we're Homestead up a little closer we're gonna to, get to Hollywood, Hollywood. Yeah. Florida. 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 And we're going to move to the actual Hollywood. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Don't forget a film Shout carpet to next Thursday, April oh, yeah. 9th, Cinema Paradiso, Fort Lauderdale, Alexander Bayo. Give me film a shout-out. Car- yeah, film yes. carpet. Uh, Shout-out to everyone as well, to uh, Jesse Lewis. Um, who else? There's a lot of people, man. McKenzie. McKenzie. We love you, McKenzie. Um, Will. Will Alexander. Yes, um, the girls. I don't know any of the girls. The girls. Oh, yeah. Fallon Rene. Shout out to Yusinia. Who? Fallon Rene. Fallon oh, Jasmine Renee. Brown. Alicia Jasmine Brown. Carreno, my business partner. Chris Aras- yeah. and my soul Aras- <laughs> All right, guys. Well, what thanks for coming on the show. And, um, you know, I, I, we love listening to uh, the projects and the 
and the real love that you guys have for your projects, mm-hmm. and it's, it's got it shows in the work that you do. Thank you. All right, Thank so uh, that appreciate you guys. Thank you, Rick. Thank, Thank you, Rick. Thank you, Rick. Ladies and gentlemen, and guy, Jorge, 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 Jorge. 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 McJorge. <laughs> McJorge. <laughs> 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 the producer wow. Barry Barry Rick Alright Thank you for having us guys Thanks yeah. Thank right. you so That was Rick Show on the radio share For this, Thursday Deb, Share it And we'll see you next week On Rick Show on the radio On right. SoFloRadio.com SoFlo Radio If you're feeling No If you're gonna stand up Shout This is the moment This is the moment Take a chance Let Life is so unkind There's a fine line between love and hate Rich and poor, right or wrong Can't take no more It's time for a change To Z Nation, your weekly dose. You're listening to SoFloRadio.com.